the revelation from Jesus Christ, which God gave to him by sending his angel, Jesus' angel, that we would know the word of God and bear testimony of Jesus Christ. Blessed is the person who understands this prophecy. Why? So you could just walk around and tell everybody that the world's going to end? No, that you can understand Jesus. Keep scrolling down. Now understand the context. That the seven churches would know who their God is. Who is the God of the seven churches? The one who is the Father. It doesn't say his name, but we know that's who it's referring to. Who was and is and is to come. The Spirit's. The seven spirit, the Holy Spirit, and Jesus Christ. How many would know now in that church, this is my God. God is the Father, he is the Son, and he is the Holy Spirit. What are the seven ways the Spirit manifests himself in those ways we read in Isaiah? What role does Jesus play and what is so important about his role in our lives? Look at it. He's the king of the earth, the firstborn among the dead. Okay, but what does that do for us? He loves us and has freed us from our sins by his blood. Everybody get this. How are you and I supposed to read the book of Revelation then? Jesus is our savior. Jesus is my savior. Jesus is the one to come and help and rescue me. Jesus is the one to make me a king and a priest in his kingdom. With Jesus, I will rule and reign. We are not supposed to read the book of Revelation separated from the revelation of Jesus being our Savior. 